today we shall be uh, continuing my complete comic book collection in the long boxes. Part one of this came out about a, I want to say about a week ago, so um, I'll put the link to that down in the description below. But anyway, without further ado, shall we continue? So this is where we left off, Batman Conf Confidential presenting the Joker. So the next one that we'll go to now is Sinestro number 5 from uh, DC. It looks like, yep, it's the new 52 under the grip of Parallax. Then after that, we've got, there we go, The Flash, Too Hot to Handle, The Fastest Man Alive number 2. Then we got Batman Detective Comics number 2, which I uh, I got that now in um, just a complete trade paperback but anyway we got convergence action comics number one of two then we got suicide squad most wanted deadshot number one then after that we got the dark side war lex luther number one from justice league then after that we got batman and robin eternal Batman Arkham Knight Genesis. Um, I really enjoyed this uh, run. I don't think I have all of them, but from the ones that I read, I really enjoyed. Yeah, because the next one that I got is uh, number three. And then after that, I've got number one. It, it was really good. I really enjoyed it. It was fun. Then we got uh, Batman and the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, number two. And then number one, mainly because I ended up buying this in a complete... Uh, trade paperback form. So the next one that we got is Brightest Day Green Arrow number three, and then two, and then one. Um, I'm going backwards because um, that's how I have it because I would be going from here but it would be a bit too hard so it's easier for me just to go like this. But um, I will go through every uh, through everything. So the next one that we got is DC Nation number zero is 25 cents. This had a couple runs in it. I want to say it had a little bit from uh, the wedding from these from uh, Batman Rebirth, but I'm not 100% sure on that. Don't quote me on that, but I do want to say it's in it. Next one that we got is the Curse of Brimstone from uh, DC Universe. It's uh, the New Age of Heroes. This was from the pages of Dark Knight Metal when they tried to do something different. It was a fun issue. I enjoyed the first one. And then we got um, Action Comics number 1000. And then we got Action Comics 999, and then 998, and then I got an older one, which this is number 509. Then we got Batman Beyond, number one from DC Rebirth, and then uh, like the prelude issue two from Batman Beyond Rebirth. And then after that, yeah, I got a lot of Rebirth titles until I decided just to start collecting them in a uh, trade paperback form. But anyway, we got Teen Titans Special. That's when Deathstroke got a hold of the Speed Force. Deathstroke number 8, 7, 6, 5. Love the artwork on that one. 4. Three, and then uh, I guess I couldn't find two and one. Next we got is uh, the Hellblazer Rebirth issue number one, and then uh, Superwoman issue five. Some of these might have been in a pack that I got. I want to say, and then Supergirl issue three because I don't think I'd actually just buy a random issue. Uh, Justice League versus Suicide Squad number twelve, and then uh, number nine. And then uh, Nightwing from uh, Rebirth, issue 1. And then Red Hood and the Outlaws, number 5. And then um, Hal Jordan and the Green Lantern Corps, number 10. And then uh, number 2. I remember actually buying that one. And number 1 as well, and I remember buying that one. And then the Prelude issue. Then Green Lanterns. I read the first two issues of this. I did enjoy it, but I decided to wait for a trade paperback. And to be honest, I still haven't picked that up. And then uh, there's the first issue. Love the artwork on that one. Then we got uh, Justice League uh, Timeless, number 19. Justice League, number 18. And then 11. 10. 3. Let me get some of the artwork going. There we go. 
the number one. Let me get the artwork because DC Universe, they always, well, DC uh, Rebirth now, they always do good artwork. Uh, it's always good to look at. It's always, always good. And then uh, the, uh, the prelude issue. And then after that, we got Adam Rebirth, number one. Haven't read it yet. Titans, number one. That was a good first uh, stepping on point. Then uh, Wonder Woman, number 17, which haven't read because I think it was just part of a pack that I got. And then uh, Wonder Woman, issue one, which I did read that one. Then we got The Flash, issue nine, which this is a tribute to the uh, famous comic page, which had Jay Garrick and Barry Allen uh, running towards... Um, I can't remember who it was. But then we got number 8, which we got Kid Flash and Flash versus Godspeed. And then we got 2. And then we got 1. Then we got uh, the Prelude one. And then we got Aquaman, 17. 5. 4. 3. 2. One, then issue one of the prelude one. Like, um, I did try to keep up with a couple of titles, but it was just kind of hard to keep up with all of them. So I just decided, like, I'll read a couple, see which one I like the best, and then I'll just move on from that point. Because no way I could afford keeping up with every single one of them. Then we got Superman issue three, issue two, then issue one. Then uh, Green Arrow was the one that I collected the most from. I want to say I have all the way up to 18 in this run. So after 18, we got 17. And this was the first series where they actually started to include uh, Diggle. 16. 15. 14. Got uh, Malcolm Merle in there. 13. 12. 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one, and then the prologue one. Then we got uh, some Batman. Looks like I got up all the way up to number 23 on Batman. This was the Tom King run. Yeah, 22, 21, 20, or 21 again, because it was, uh, that's Flash, technically, but it was part of the Button storyline, which I own in a trade paperback now, too. 20. 19. Love the way that they made Two-Face look. 18. 17. 16. 15. 14. 13, 12, 11, maybe, 10, 9, 8, that was the uh, Monster Men crossover, 7, 6, 5, 4, Three, two, and one. And then the Pro Luke one. So that is everything in the short long box. And the next video will be going over the long long box. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and a subscribe so I know to keep making more of these. If you have any video requests, please put them down in the comments below. I will do my best to reply. Part 3 of this will be coming out shortly. Thanks for watching again, and I will see all of you in the next video. Bye!